Good morning, Paul Robson. Good morning. How are you doing, Angela? I'm great. We're down here at New Jersey Motorsports Park with the CCS Series. How do you feel today? Really good. Gre weather's great. You know, had a good day yesterday. Got in some good ra good runs, good races. So I'm looking forward to today. It's going to be a blast. Great. That's great. I uh, followed you in Carolina. You did really well down there. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. It was, uh, it was a challenge. Um, I'd never been to that track before. Um, I had a few brake issues, so that kind of was playing with uh, playing with my mind a bit. But uh, it's a fun track, and uh, yeah, it was a good turnout and some fun racing. With this being your third season racing CCS, I think having like setbacks is part of the game, correct? Oh yeah, naturally. I mean, you expect that. I mean, I uh, I try and bring as many spare parts and that sort of stuff with me. Um, keep the bike in good shape. I mean. You know, the guys who work on my bike, Washington Cycle Works, they're awesome. Uh, I couldn't recommend them more. Um, you know, and just try and, uh, try and keep everything race ready. Are you, so you can never be too prepared for a track day. Not track day, I'm sorry, for a race day. Oh, either. You know, you never know. Um, but, yeah, spare parts, you know, fluids, you never know what's going to happen. All right, something very important that I know you and your wife are advocates of are the, um, the air vests that we're seeing more and more racers yeah. using for races. Is that true? Oh, yeah, I think this is great. I mean, I've had... I've had the opportunity, for better or for worse, to use it three times, and I'm sure it's helped me out in all cases. Um, I mean, I don't even feel it when I'm riding, you know, which I think some people like get concerned about that it's going inter to interfere with their getting off the bike. I really don't even feel it. Um, you know, they've got two different models, one for racing, one for more like better protection track days. Um, but I, I just think they're great, I, and I know friends who've, you know, been told I would have been much more seriously injured without the vest. Uh, so. I think it's I think it's some of the best money you can spend. I agree. I have one as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Paul, sponsorships are very important in this industry of motorcycle racing, obviously because it's a financial cost for us, and it's great to get sponsors. Uh, how are your feelings on sponsorship? I, you know, I anything they can do to help support us, support the sport, I think is great. Um, do you yourself actively chase sponsors? Yeah, I, I don't. Um, I have, you know, I have some people who I work with closely that I've, you know, I've worked with for years. I mean, I mentioned Washington Cycle. Um, you know, team promotion. I mean, I'd be I'd be nowhere without team promotion. I uh, I started with team promotion must have been 10, 11 years ago. I mean, I remember taking Art Basic uh, with Billy Sink. Yeah, you know, and um, you know the, the parts club, um, Pirelli tires through you know Metric Devil Moto. Um, those are really you know those are the, my top guys. Uh, and how about your wife? Oh, I can't say enough about my wife. My, <laughs> without a doubt, my better half, the brains behind the operation. Uh, she doesn't get enough credit. She's out here every weekend. With well, I'm actually going to interview her later. Yeah, she's she's wonderful. She is, she's my pit boss. She's my support system. She's everything. That's awesome. Uh, Paul, I wish you the best of luck today. Thank you, Angela. Thank All you. Right.